Hello everyone, Brian from Red River. Today we're going to go over how to get some community involvement into your Microsoft Stream videos. We've shown you how you can upload videos directly into Microsoft Stream, as well as do quick edits on the fly. Today we're going to go over how you can actually get some viewer interaction inside the Microsoft video, Stream videos. Inside of Microsoft Stream, if you're logged into a video that you've uploaded or you have admin mode turned on in the top right, you will see the transcript that we talked about before, as well as an interactivity tab. Viewers of the videos always have the ability to add comments and like and share it with other members in the organization. As a content creator, you have the ability to embed forms directly into the video to drive direct feedback from the viewers. In the top, click on interactivity and click add form. You're gonna get the option to paste the URL. If you don't have it, you can always click the button to go directly to Microsoft Forms. Microsoft Forms is an application that we're gonna talk about a little bit later. But for now, if you've created a form, you can select it, click on share, and click copy on the URL. Once you've done that, you can paste it directly into the video, choose the name for the form, and choose the position, the timeline that you want this form to show. Dragging along in the video timeline will change when that form pops up for users to go ahead and interact with the video itself. Once you've selected the appropriate time, click add to timeline. You'll be able to see all the forms you uploaded into this, and there'll be a visual notification when this comes up. After the user selected the form, they can click continue video to move along. And that's it. Microsoft provides a nice and easy way for you to solicit direct feedback from the viewers of your videos. I hope that was helpful. Remember to like and subscribe and join us again next week. Bye.